Hello friends, I am Balaji and today I am going to discuss with you about one of the problem which you have encountered once you have downloaded Visual Studio 2017. The problem is the Visual Studio 2017 by default doesn't include a report viewer control and uh, report viewer project. For example, if I want to add a report to this means I want to add a new item to this. and then here I will search for report but see here it does not uh, found any report because by default uh, Visual Studio 2017 does not have report control. It does not have that uh, report your control also in, uh, in its toolbox also. So today we are going to see how to install this uh, report viewer control in your Visual Studio 2017. For that first to open your browser and then go to the url marketplace.visualstudio.com in this website uh, you will find all plugins uh, for your visual studio here only we are going to search for that report viewer control here you want to query for the package which is the, which is the name microsoft rdlc report designer means first we are going to search for the report designer which we will add by clicking uh, right clicking solution explorer new item and then we will search for that report of data okay for visual studio Here it is Microsoft or RDLC report designer for Visual Studio. Download this package. In my case, I have already downloaded this package. Once you have downloaded that package, go to that package and then double click this uh, extension. Before you actually done that, you will you want to close Visual Studio, otherwise, it will create some problem while installing this package. It takes some time to install. Click install. It takes some time and then it will install. Close and then reopen our Visual Studio. and then I open my existing project now we will add a report document to our project go to solution explorer right click this add new item Now we will search for report. See, it has added report and report wizard to our Visual Studio. So, it is available here. Now I won't demonstrate you how to create report, how to use this report control model because it is not motto of this tutorial. It is the motto of this tutorial is to how to install the missing report your control to your Visual Studio. So just click cancel, we will also check whether that our toolbox also have a report viewer control. See now, but our toolbox does not have that report viewer control because uh, we want to add another one package for to this local project and then we want to add that uh, report viewer control to this toolbox. For that, in order to install a package, go to this uh, project, click manage NuKid packages and then here you want to type the package name click this browse and then 
you want to type the package name which you want to download see here it is you want to install this package click this uh, download it will ask for your permission click ok click uh, I accept it will take some time to install that report your control to your current project Now it has successfully installed uh, that um, report your control. It actually successfully installed that. Now go to your um, form designer page. Go to toolbox. Search for report. Till till now it doesn't add any report your control to your toolbox. So you want to manually add that um, DLL to this um, toolbox. For that I will create first of all I will create a new tab to this with a name report to group this uh, control in a proper and then right click this toolbox again click choose items click browse go to your uh, project directory this is my project name so under uh, inside your project tree now project directory now you will find a new folder called packages go to that packages within that uh, go to this uh, report viewer leave and then select this uh, microsoft.reportviewer.winforms.dll now it added that report viewer and then click ok see now it has added that report viewer control to our toolbox now we can drag and drop this and then we can use that report viewer control on our project so this is the way to add report viewer control to your visual studio 2017 please like this video and subscribe to my channel thank you